Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for January 15th and 16th, Wednesday and Thursday for my Virgos. Hello, my Virgos. How are you? Well, this is Wednesday, Thursday, and you know I use my Radley Valentine Archangel Power Tarot cards. Yes, I've prayed, meditated, and infused the deck with Reiki energy. But remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like. Leave the rest, okay? Okay, we're going to go right into our reading. Remember, I'm an intuitive channeler. What that means is I open myself up to my higher power spirit and whatever the message that needs to come out, comes out. Now, one, two, and three. All three of your cards are face down, but they're also reversed. And reversed means to me, pay, pay a little more attention. Okay? Okay. So let's see what we have for my Virgos. First card, peace. Archangel Azrael. This is a really great card. Now, I mean, I'm, the, the energy I'm getting from this is wonderful. It, it's kind of like now, you know, are you waking up this Wednesday, Thursday in a very solid place where you feel comfortable with the energy around you? Is this a place, is this a word to tell you that, hey, you need to go into that place? Some of it is, you know, it, it's yes to both, okay? But this is kind of saying to you also, there is a, more of a supernatural being out there. There's that, you know, higher power, guardian angel, spirit guide, voice of the universe, your divine, whoever that is. But there is a supernatural element out there that's guiding a lot of your steps, that's actually guide, it's guiding a lot of your steps. Now, we can always, as we go down our pathway, we do have choices within that pathway, but it's still like this is still a pathway that's almost been designed for you. I don't know why I'm getting more, you know, this more, you know, it, 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 this is just what's coming out for me. So this is a, this is a um, kind of a word to tell you to be comfortable in your pathway, to know that what you're doing, that you are on that right, you are on that right trail. You are doing what you're supposed to be doing, okay? And the lessons that you're learning, and you know, I hate lessons like that too. I like I like lessons that are like, oh, here, this is wonderful for you. And it's not always, you know, that's not life. Life is about challenges, but this is about you. So if you're feeling, if you're feeling, um, if you don't have the confidence in what you're, you know, that you're do, going the right path, this is to say, yes, you are, okay? Release the past, and that's really very, very, because, you know, to go forward, you know, you can't, you, you know, uh, you know, you, you can't be um, chained down to the past, okay, because that keeps you living in that past. So it's, again, release the past. There is a more enriching future coming. Let go and let God. Okay, next card is the Empress. So here we have, and again, remember, these are all three of these are face down, but they're all reversed, and you are having... This is the second Archangel energy card, okay? The Empress is Archangel Gabriel, the divine messenger. Um, you know, so, uh, you know, many times over, it's like you're going to hear news, but the Empress is also, I really, I really kind of liken her to like the Queen of Earth, except more, okay? The Queen, you know, and you're this Earth energy. So be prepared to receive, be prepared to to, um, to, well, be prepared to receive, okay? So, you know, this is kind of like, you know, maybe maybe this is, okay, a natural um, type of an example is you're going for your review and, you know, and they're talking to you and you're kind of like, oh, I don't really like the critique, but at the same time, then you get your, then they tell you what your bonus is going to be and you're like, oh, okay, that's much better than what I thought, okay? Because one of the things, too, for my Virgos is, you know, you don't, um, you know, you take everything, you take a lot of things. I shouldn't be so, well, you take, you know, you take a lot of things to heart, okay? And, you know, somebody might give you 20 compliments and then the 21 first might be the little bit, well, but this is what you could do better. And that's what you ruminate over, okay? So be at peace, be, be ready to receive. So this is time to act upon your plans. Creativity is rewarded, luxurious or abundant resources. So 
you know, if this is a time for you with that review, that, you know, be prepared. Be prepared to receive. Your last card, again reversed, is the Knight of Michael. Now, Michael is air energy, and that's Aquarius, which is our next season coming up. Gemini and Libra, it's thought processes, it's Wi-Fi, and it's, again, hearing news, okay? So whatever this, these two are telling you, and this is really extremely divine type of energy for you this Wednesday, Thursday, and because of what you, re, what you hear, because you know you're on that right path, it's telling you not to be afraid to go forward, and it might be telling you not to be afraid to take a risk, okay? You're going to have to make that decision. But the news that you hear, the things that you know, it's going to be, it's going to move you forward that much quicker. And remember, the nights to me are always very directional. They see that, they go for that. Okay. Strong, committed, intellectual, diligent. Time to move quickly. Choose logic over emotion, sudden changes. So, you know, when these changes come, be at peace and be ready to receive. Okay. Um, just, just this Wednesday, Thursday, it's kind of this roll you know i'm kind of getting that rolling 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 i won't sing for you okay so my virgos if you enjoyed my reading please remember to like share subscribe and click on the bell it does help to support the channel so i thank you but as always my virgos know that you are loved and be blessed Bye bye